Hey, what's up, everybody? Your favorite uh, YouTuber, Frankie Slosson, aka the Frankie Slosson Show, is here. And uh, while well, this is my first video of 2009, I'm sorry I was a little late. I, uh, I was busy the other day. Uh, what did I have to do? I, well, I had to work uh, New Year's Eve night, and which kind of sucked, but I didn't really have a whole lot planned. It would have been nice to, to see the ball drop and all that, but I was, uh, I had to work, you know, at the grocery store, or at the store, you know, since I do overnight st uh, stock, you know, not overnight or whatever. Uh, it was just myself and my boss, so that was kind of, kind of crazy, but, uh, uh, so no, I never had the chance to, uh, to celebrate New Year's the way I wanted to, but it, then again, I didn't have hardly much money or whatever to do that, so, but I was, uh, I was interested, I actually had took the time when I had a free moment to actually watch some of my some people I've subscribed to and who have subscribed to me some of their videos like I watch on MJ's uh, New Year, Ring of a New Year video plus their uh, first reenactment spoof that they did for the new year which I thought was pretty cool I liked the uh, it's like Sean's, vi or Sean's video uh, where they're ready the new year and, and the first if you haven't watched it you gotta watch it, a cool new year's video uh, and, uh, MJ and Sean, Sean MJ bring up the new year or whatever. It's funny because in the first part, uh, Sean, uh, it's about four minute long video, but Sean uh, makes fun of MJ uh, because of his girlfriend or whatever. I, you know, think that, I think she had a Spanish last name or I don't, even, I don't even know. Uh, but it was funny because Sean was speaking Spanish, or whatever. And I thought I heard him say like Mar Marina, Helena, Bologna, something, something, Kelly. So it was just funny. You gotta watch that. Then I watch uh, Patrick Butler's uh, video. Uh, yes, I uh, mentioned Patrick Butler again. Good guy though. Uh, he he surprised me in, in his uh, Christmas video that he, when he went to his grandparents, he he mentioned a little bit about me in his uh, you know when he opened up his WWE uh, DVD board game that he got. Uh, he said this is for Frankie for Frankie Slauson. I was like holy shit you know. Uh, I mean holy crap. Uh, I was kind of surprised so I appreciate that again. Uh, so, so to return the favor, I mentioned your name again, the great Patrick Butler. Check out his channel. He gets a lot of cool stuff. Uh, his username is STCO23. I call him Sitco23. I don't even know if that's the right, the correct way to, to say it. Uh, let's see. What else did I watch? I watched Shane Jensen's. Uh, <clears throat> watch Shane Jensen's uh, Ring of the New Year video, which was pretty cool. He was watching Dick Clark rock New Year's Eve, and it's kind of kind of. Uh, great that uh, Dick Clark, after all the stuff he's been through, uh, you can tell that he's kind of a lot older now and, and can hardly pronounce his words right like he used to because of his stroke that he had. Or, uh, but uh, he's still he's still on rock in the new year once again. I don't know how long else he's going to do this for, but but uh, hopefully as long as he can. But Shane Jensen was enjoying that, and so I enjoyed watching that uh, Shane Jensen video. And then I watched uh, a guy that I just started becoming friends with, who I've subscribed to. Uh, for a little while, I just never really chatted with him until now. Uh, Firefox, I think, DVD guy or 3D DVD guy. Uh, you know, Batman. Uh, he's a, he was, I forgot what, what his other DVD. Hardcore DVD fan? Yeah, I think that was as far as he was saying. Like, Firefox 3 something something. I don't know. I, I forgot what it was. He, I'm sure he'll correct me. Uh, anyway, I uh, just became, started chatting with him and uh, enjoyed his uh, New Year videos and uh, also the uh, talk about the New Year's resolutions. Yeah, I mean, New Year's resolutions, I know that I made that in the other video. I was hoping that uh, Pop Tub would, uh, the reason why I made that video was uh, I was hoping that uh, YouTube user Pop Tub would actually use that video because they were talking about, uh, you know, all you got to do if you want to be featured in our, our little two minute segment that we do every day, uh, all you got to do is. Uh, uh, say what New Year's, what your New Year's resolutions are, and we'll feed you. So that's why I made that little video. I, you know, it wasn't the quality. Yes, was kind of crappy or not, but uh, it was you know it was it was okay. I mean, I, I thought it would be good enough for what they wanted, but uh, I didn't, as far as I know, I haven't got featured yet, and probably never will. But who knows? Who knows? You never know. But uh, so I was watching the uh, uh, hardcore DVD fans, uh, aka Batman, his. Uh, New Year DVD or uh, New Year video, his first video of 2009, 2009. Uh, 
what but uh, that he rearranged his furniture, rearranged his DVD collection, uh, moved you know moved his TV to another spot, went in the house and all that. So I thought that was pretty cool. And it's really cool to know that he's from Iowa, you know, because I'm from, you know obviously from Minnesota, so we're we're not that far away, maybe within a few hours or whatnot. So that's pretty cool. Uh, that that's well, it sounds pretty cool anyway. Uh, who else can I give a shout out to that I watch their videos? Uh, I think that's pretty well. The five awesome guys, and, and it's funny because you know I've been subscribed to them for a short time, but they've been doing. They did their uh, YouTube project, which lasted pretty much a whole year of two thousand eight, and and now they're done. But they're they're doing their uh, uh, individual channels, which they've been doing for quite a while anyway. Prior to that, but uh, that's how they gained popularity with the five awesome guys. And now I've just started watching their videos, so it's just like, oh boy, I've I've pretty much missed out, you know, the whole whole year of what they've been doing because they got some pretty cool videos it's a lot a lot are very informal some are just funny you know just for the sake of humor uh but but most of them are pretty educational i, I was really surprised by uh, how smart these guys are they they actually know what they're talking about i think that's what made their their show a success and it would be kind of cool if i could get a group of guys together or girls or whatever uh so my subscribers if we got together and did something like that you know like it doesn't have to be a whole year but, uh, you know, something like that, and maybe it would help our channel, you know, get us some subscribers, you know. Oh, yeah, and then I watched a guy named uh, Brando Man, but he did, not I, I don't know, I don't think he did anything for New Year's. I think he just did the recent ones I've watched, in words, is a uh, uh, shout-out to Tom Man 68 which uh, another guy that I started watching his videos, I haven't subscribed to that long, just started subscribing to uh, then he did his Christmas video, Brad Man did, what he got for uh, Christmas in a fast little video thing. Uh, so, yeah, the top man is 68. I don't really know much about you. I just started watching your videos. Uh, so I don't really know a whole lot. I've heard a lot about you from, from Sean and MJ, the uh, cool dooter, and uh, Shane Jensen one night. So I don't really know a whole lot about you, uh, but I figure I'd give you a shout out anyway. You know, whether you watch my videos or not, I have no idea. You know, you probably don't, but uh, who knows. Uh, but I, I'm just kind of proposing what, what well, the whole point of the shout out in the first video of New Year is I'm proposing that some of us get together and actually do, like, you know, like not try to steal anything from the five awesome guys, but we could be the new five awesome guys, or we could have a different title or something like that, you know, to get ourselves out there. I think it's the, the best way for us to team up, you know five of us or four of us or whatever to team up to do like a like to, to make a channel a youtube channel this kind of like they did but to do something it's not a project but just something to do to see if we can get anybody out there to get a shout out to anybody out there you know to view our stuff i think it's the best way for us to be successful on youtube because i would love to get a lot of subscribers you know because you know you put a lot of effort in a video and when nobody hardly watches or nobody hardly uh, submits comments or whatever, it's kind of it's kind of sad. I mean, it, it really is. Because I'm not trying to say that I want to gain popularity because everybody has to start from the bottom up. But it's it's just the best way to uh, to get our videos out there. So what I'm suggesting is that some of us get together, whether it's my, you know, myself, whether it's Ron Fox or Pool Duder or Tyler the Man 68 or Brando Man or... Fire or hardcore DVD fan, uh, Sitco Twenty Three, Patrick Butler, uh, Shane Jensen, uh, anybody, any of us. Wet Movie One, uh, Chris Stillwell, uh, hardcore, uh, 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 you know, just any of us. Wet Movie One, Brendan Mitchell, any of us get together and come up with an idea for one YouTube channel for all of us to help get our subscriber base really out there. And uh, not taking anything from the five awesome guys because they did a great job. But now that they're done, they need. To, I think I feel that they need somebody to replace them, and we could be the next five awesome people, you know, or five awesome guys on on the YouTube, the next top in the town. So let, let's think about this idea. Let me know what you think. Please put uh, comments down below. Subscribe to my channel, uh, and uh, hope for good videos in two thousand nine. And so I want to wish everybody a happy New Year, and. I'm Frankie Slauson, over and out.